What's up, collective? It's your girl, Monica. We give the tarot 777 here today to just do a collective reading for you guys. I've been busy doing my own thing, so look, you're not going to be seeing me every day up here. I'll be trying to get my readings out, but I mean, I work, you guys. I have a job. Uh, look, this is not my full-time job, so I do this as a hobby. It's entertaining, and I just want to give you guys the message it's not something i'm looking forward you know as far as like payment you know i see people up here like scare share subscribe donate to the channel okay if you do you do if you don't believe you me there is god has prepared a way for me where this is for entertainment purposes only this is not a full-time job for me so yes i have a life i'll be busy i got things to do i got money that needs to be made but in the same token, I do like to share my messages because there are still things going on that people need to see, hear, and talk about. Let's get this read, y'all. Let's go. Alrighty, Holy Spirit, Angel, Ancestor, guys. I'm using a little bit of my deck today just to pull a little bit of energies, Father God, Holy Spirit, Angels, and Ancestors. Give me the message for my collective. Let it be a message that they all are in relative to. Well, it'd be a karmic, a twin flame. I really don't believe in that shit because I had a twin flame. My twin flame betrayed me. So I really do believe twin flames are here just for a message. Thinking about you. Who the hell? This could be your goddamn twin flame or karmic that's thinking about you. We all know. But someone's thinking about you. Let me turn this camera. Somebody's thinking about you. This is a song by Frank Ocean. Oh, and they fucked up too. They know they fucked up and they in regrets. Ooh, because you probably told a motherfucker what's going on. They thinking about what the fuck you told them. Somebody fucked up. Ooh, Scorpio for some of you. Ooh, gel time. Somebody fucked up. But let's keep going, y'all. This is the message. Some of y'all, these are the messages that are relating. There's a Scorpio. There's somebody doing gel time. There's somebody thinking about you. For some of y'all, this is your person. For some of y'all, this is about to be the message. Holy Spirit, angel, ancestor, guys. Is there any more messages? Cookie, hush, hush, hush. You're not getting no more chicken. I already gave you some. That's it. Some of y'all could be dealing with a greedy motherfucker. Want more than what the fuck you can bargain for. You've already shared and they want to be greedy. Animalistic style. Yeah. Whining for some shit. Some of y'all, your person is real whiny, codependent, complain. Ain't nobody got time for that. That's your person. I pick up this energy and it, look, sage every goddamn thing. This person is evil. I picked that up too. Anyway, Holy Spirit, angel, ancestor, guides, what is the energy? What is the message for these people today? Gold. Somebody getting some gold. Favorite color could be gold. Someone's thinking about something with gold. Could be a marriage. Proposal. Ooh, court case. Mm-hmm. I keep seeing that. And this Scorpio again. Because some of y'all said damn Scorpio. In the dark came out to the light. Whatever it was that was going on with your person who's a Scorpio, whatever it was, it came to the light. Something about some gold. Gold is what? Money? Color? Something. I don't know. Holy Spirit, angel, ancestor, guys. What are the messages relating to thinking about you in gold? Can you give me a card to connect it to? Yo, Devon Masculine, when we just talking about this, I just pulled this energy. The minute that I felt it, it just started rolling off the top of my tongue. It's a Devon Masculine trying to come in. So this will be a Devon Feminine, Devon Masculine message. And I automatically can tell you now, this Devon Masculine is thinking about you because they want to come in and offer you some gold. Gold, we can think about money. Gold, we can think about a gold ring. Gold, I mean, it's something st stable. I mean, if you think about gold bars something stable someone's thinking about some stability with you is what i feel your divine masculine is yep 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 that's what's going on your divine masculine is thinking about you mm, 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 and no longer wanting to be toxic they could be coming out of some toxicity toxics in reverse yep could be wanting to work work on things job they no longer want to be toxic and they want to work on things, guys. Your person wants to come out of toxicity and they want to work on things. That's what's going on. Your person wants to come out of toxicity with you guys and work on things. That's exactly where we're going to leave them at, right there. Somebody wants to work on things with you. Let's see 
Let's pull from the right away deck and see what it is. What they want, want it, what they want to come in. This is you guys with the Queen of Wands. This is someone who is intelligent, independent, honest, integrity. You guys hold integrity. You guys got clarity. You guys come correct. And this could be, you know, for some of you, your divine masculine wanting to come to you guys. Yeah. Let's see. Clarify the divine masculine gold and thinking about you. What is this message here that I pulled? What is this? Damn, someone. Didn't I say your person want to come in and talk to y'all and tell y'all something? I said they want to come in and propose that they've been thinking about you. They want to make some type of commitment. Some type of love offer love offer is what's going on. But for some of y'all, I think like in the past, you guys may have been holding back, not wanting to give them this. Yeah, well, let me see why. It could be due to some betrayal. Oh, shit. Look at this. This shit done flew right. The masculine, I'm going to leave him there because every time he, that's what he's coming in. to. Your divine masculine is coming in to tell you something. I'm going to tell you that right now. That's exactly what's going on. The divine masculine is coming in to tell you something. Mm -hmm. Yep, you could have detached from this person in the past. Somebody that uh, may have needed to go into some type of healing. This was someone, you know, um, that didn't back down, that got exhausted. You guys could have got exhausted with, you know, and detached from this person. Yeah. That's exactly what could have happened. Two, six, eight, nine. And then with the nine of wands, they're no longer wanting you to put your guard up. No wanting to, oh, you no longer wanted to defend this situation about this new start. That's what happened in the past. Hell yeah. This person you detached from. Yup, because they had you feeling stuck. You back, you didn't back down as far as the, the, this detachment. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Yep. 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 Somebody didn't fight for this. They no longer felt that this was worthy and let it go. I feel it was you guys. You guys or maybe your person in the past may have felt that you guys wasn't worthy. They may have detached. They probably, you know, someone probably didn't fight for this new start. You know, them may not have fought for this new start with you guys. Wands is about passion. Some of y'all, this could be a fire sign. Some of y'all, this could be a Scorpio. Some of y'all, this could be a water sign or a fire sign. Take it as it resonates. Let's see. Clarify the page of wands. Page of wands is somebody immature coming in wanting to tell you something. Uh, didn't I tell you they want to close out this cycle? I already told you what it is when I first pulled the gold in thinking about you. When I saw thinking about you and I saw gold, I knew it was a water sign because it was a ocean. For some of y'all, look, y'all could live by the ocean. Some of y'all name is Frank. I'm going to tell you that right now because I picked that up right now. But your person, this divine masculine, is wanting their divine feminine and they're wanting to close out the cycle. They're wanting to complete something, some fate, some luck here, some cycle someone is wanting to complete. They're passionately wanting to close out this cycle. I already said they want to marry you. And someone, they probably want to come in and tell that they close that they want to close out this cycle with you a scorpio an aquarius a taurus or a leo somebody with the letter t r l u a o n s is what i see here mm -hmm. i see aquarius is in here i see a fire sign is in here i see an earth sign is in here i see an air sign is in here I see a lot. I see a snake is in this motherfucker. So I'm surprised I don't see the seven of cups. Somebody who they made an option. Somebody was an option in the past. And now they're coming in wanting to make you no, no more options. They want to just commit only to you. This is what I said already. I, I, I picked the energy up the minute that I pressed start. This shit done came over to me. And I, and I already was telling y'all how I work. How I got other things to do. This is probably what y'all be telling y'all person. Y'all ain't got time for this. Y'all too busy doing other things. But this person is wanting to come in and make an offer. Some news about marriage is what I feel. Closing out this cycle. Destiny. They're wanting blessings. Something faded. An inevitable change is what's here, y'all. I'm telling you, your person's coming back. And they want some. I'm telling you, look, person from the back. From the past. I said from the back. Shit, they may want to hit it from the back. This Your person's coming back. They may have left in the past, but that motherfucker about to come right back around full-fledged. I should see the Eight of Cups in reverse. Somebody from the past right here. Some nostalgia, harmony that you may have had. You may not have it at this time because it showed some other cards. Yeah, but let's move forward. Right now, this here is um, 
a childhood memory. Somebody wants a reunion, which I already declared. Some peace here, some pleasure with the will. They want to be happy with you closing out this cycle. They want to be har harmonious with you guys. They want a reunion with you guys. This is somebody from your past. Somebody who you do not live together. Nah, uh-uh. You may have made plans, talked about it, but just never got there. I see these two people on the, on the outs talking. This person could be trying to come in and move in with you guys. For some of you, mm-hmm. For some of you, this could be a new love. Somebody who you may want to close out the cycle with. You're going around telling your friends, telling everybody that your divine mas masculine is coming in. Could be someone younger. Could be someone older. But they constantly think about you and they're trying to offer you this gold. Look at this man wearing this gold. I'm telling you. It's somebody's trying to get married. They're trying to settle down. They're trying to get stable, want kids. You know? That's what I see what's going on here. Clarify the Wheel of Fortune with the Page of Wands, Spirit, for my collective. I think I did those three by accident, but I'm not even tripping. It is what it is. Yeah, they want to close out. You guys are single. Again, this is a pre-empress type of energy right here. With the Nine of Pentacles, this talks about material comfort, reaping some type of reward, harvest, and abundance. This, your person wants to come in, close out this cycle, and they want to be abundant with you. They want to close out a cycle of you being single. Look all these single goddamn people in here. They don't want you single no more, sweetheart. Look at the gold. You're the empress. I, I see an empress, and I see an emperor. Some of you, this could be an Aries. This could be a Taurus for some of you guys. Mm-hmm. But for most of you, this is your dim divine masculine. And what they're telling you is that they want to come in, close this cycle. They don't want you to be single. They want you two guys to come together as one is what I'm seeing here. Did, did, the, did, did I? God damn. I'm dead. This will be a short video because I don't need to keep going. I already know what's going on here. I just said that this person right here wants some type of union, some type of marriage. Didn't I say that they already want some type of stability? Didn't we already see that? I saw that somewhere in the cards. Look, keep up because I, once I get out of it, I'm gone. And, and look, somebody else is saying the same thing. Maybe your person, maybe you guys. Keep up because once I get out of here, I'm gone. Anyway, here is the uh, four wands. So yeah, like I said, someone's looking for some stability, harmony, success. Someone's trying to complete the phase and start again. They like, can we start again? Remember, we saw the Ace of Pentacles in reverse. There was some type of new salt. I mean, new salt. Oh, shit. Some of y'all friends is going to be salty as hell about this shit. About them not getting picked. Because, yep, 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 yep. Somebody mad. I think it's a karmic. Is mad at your person. Your divine masculine is because they chose to come in and want to close the cycle out with you. Not this person who may have been a karmic, who have, may have thought they were celebrating some family, some long-term reunion, some relationship. Oh, no, darling. It says divine masculine is thinking about you. You guys, your divine masculine is thinking about you with this gold. Didn't we saw gold? Isn't it gold back here? Isn't it gold here? Happiness. Happiness. Your person wants to come in and let you know that you make them happy. They want to close out this cycle with all this giving and taking. And maybe they want to close out a cycle with a Scorpio, a Taurus, a Aries. I don't know why I got Aries, but this is a Leo. Maybe not Aries. It's Leo that they want to close out with. Or an Aquarius. Mm -hmm. Or Cancer. Or your person got Cancer and close out the cycle with them. This person who was independent. Mm -hmm. Single. And wanted marriage, wanted your person to offer them or some type of proposal, but that is not happening. Your person is coming back, and I already saw that. It, I mean, I'm telling you right now, huh? I already saw it. So your person coming back for sure, for sure. We'll look and see when. But for right now, oh yeah, they offering. Look at that gold. They coming in. Your divine masculine is coming in to let you know this looks like a ring. I see a ring in here with a fucking finger through here. They coming in to want to marry you. Look, look, look. She look. She's wearing it. A bird talks about communication. Look at the bird on her finger. They want to come in and communicate about how they want marriage. Yep. For some of y'all, y'all going for it. I don't know, y'all. I'm just going to keep on looking. I don't know. I, I don't know if it's good or bad. I don't know. It says divine masculine. We have going to have to keep going, but they definitely want this family. Ooh, I said Leo. Ooh, didn't I say Leo? I said not Aries, but a Leo. 
This is the person too who wanted that family with your divine masculine. They was trying to tame themselves. They wanted this family. This is somebody else who is single. I'm telling you, they're fucking Leo. They met this person in the month of motherfucking August, which causes goddamn change between you and your person because they took on another third party and they had to tame this motherfucker. This bitch was this bitch was all over the place. This Leo, whoever it was, this is who they're closing this fucking cycle out with. And this bitch is back to being single. They could have got a divorce from this motherfucker. And now this mother bitch don't got the strength. This nigga don't got the strength to carry on in this family. Now that your person done closed out of cycle. I'm telling y'all this was a karmic. Somebody was a karmic Leo. With Taurus or Earth or... I feel... I feel fire. That's all I get. I don't know what the main sign is, but I know they have fire in their chart. There's fire in that person's chart that your divine masculine was with who was a fucking karmic. And your person may have closed out a cycle. For some of y'all, it's a Scorpio. I do. I picked that up. Remember in the beginning, it said it was a Scorpio? Remember, your person fucked up and they realized that they fucked up. That's why they coming back to you. That's why they trying to let you know, I fucked up. I closed out the cycle with that other karmic. I'm trying to offer you love, affection, stability. I don't want you alone. And, I mean, they're having to tame themselves in this situation. They're having the patience. Someone's needing some self-control. I think it's the other karmic. That other karmic is needing some fucking self-control now that your divine masculine let them know that they are karmic. That they were there just to learn a lesson. Ain't that what I said earlier in the beginning? I don't know where I got that from. I was like, yeah, y'all. And for all those that think about this divine masculine thing, that's bullshit. Remember I said that? I said they just here to teach you a fucking lesson and that's it. Well, guess what? Your person coming back because they learned the motherfucking lesson. And it, it they, they got the strength. It's going to, it took a lot of patience, a lot, but they got betrayed. Yup, they got betrayed by the hand that, that, the, the hand that fed them, bit them. The karmic that fed them, bit them. Yup, yup, this is your person. This is them that they was fucking with. Somebody in the mid cold, somewhere where there's mountains. This person had red flags. Look at that person giving up that ass. Passionately, look at them. Aggressive, look. A fucking pussy. Telling you right here, for some of y'all, this is a bitch. And that's your man right there. Your Devon masculine, that's why he's in the white. Yeah, for some of y'all, the person they was fucking with was a Leo. person you was fucking with was a Leo. But th yeah, yeah. Could have, they, they could have, this was a karmic. Oh my God, didn't I say Scorpio? Here's the death card right here. So for some of y'all, y'all person got, the person they was fucking with got fire in their chart. The person your divine masculine is got war in their chart. Specifically, I want to say Scorpio. Whoever it was, they put it in. Didn't I say that? They ended it with this person. And that's why this person is mad. Because you know why? They already... I did, did. I'm stuttering. It's, it's, let me just keep moving. Y'all already heard me. I already told y'all this is what was going on. And just so, so I'm burping and everything. I can't even get the words out. Your Devon Masculine is coming in because they've been thinking about you. They want to close out this cycle and offer you some type of marriage that they're coming in to tell you. They're having the patience and the strength. They're wanting to put an ending to all that being single. You being single or them being out here with other people. Whatever it is, they're thinking about you. And this is your Devon Masculine. I already told y'all, I don't mess around with that twin flame bullshit. I uh, know nah, because I, I am a twin flame and my twin flame betrayed me. Soulmates, yeah, there are many of them, but you only get one twin flame. And to be honest, a twin flame is there to teach you a lesson. If they don't get the fucking lesson, then there's no point in y'all two going back together because they still going to keep you in this karmic cycle, this cycle. But I may, I don't see that because they're coming in telling you about some family. That they're hoping to tame this situation that they're wanting to end. For some of y'all, they could be ending some shit with that other person that, yeah. They could have told you that they close out a cycle with a Taurus, a Virgo, or a Capricorn, yo. That's why that bird, you know that bird, look at that ring. They're coming in to let you know. The bird with that ring, something went on about that goddamn marriage. Something with that bird. There's some type of communication coming on about this family, longevity, marriage, something. And look, and then with the damn four of wands, you gonna hear about this. Somebody's getting some news about what went on in this goddamn family, this fake-ass marriage, fake-ass relationship. Hell yeah. You take one of them goddamn wands away like what he got, he coming in to tell you about this third party. That's what I see. That's what he coming in to tell you about a fucking third party. Somebody. Mm-hmm. I'm surprised I don't see the goddamn high priestess 
And y'all probably already know this person. A motherfucking Pisces or a Cancer. Take it as it resonates. Your person can have cancer in their chart. Some type of water sign. I put the death to this fucking Leo and this family. Now this bitch is single. Not wanting to close out the cycle. And can be trying to come back to your person. Wanting them to get married to them. But this person is thinking about you. We already saw this clear as crystal. Frank Ocean thinking about you, goddammit. And then we looked at gold. I said gold, didn't I? I said, hey, y'all. Somebody want to get married, didn't we? And then I started talking about Twin Flame and all this other shit. I don't even know where I get that from because I'm not even into that. But this is that reading. So I will be posting it. That your divine masculine wants his fucking... He's thinking about you. A divine fem feminine. So maybe for some of y'all, maybe your person isn't a karmic. Maybe they did get that. I mean, I should see the temperance card to, to let me know that someone's been saved. Mm-hmm. Yep, your person, I feel, has been saved. You guys are getting justice, fairness in this situation here. That's justice, fair. Um, this could be with an air sign, like I said. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Um, I mean, someone's wanting to balance things out. Someone's wanting to be fair, come in with the truth. I'm telling you. Listen, I'm telling you, this is why he's been, this is what your divine masculine has been thinking about. Coming in. Thinking about, ooh, nah, nah, nah. Got me thinking about, think, thinking about you, girl. I'm trying to catch up with the words. Or do you ever think sometimes? Hey, well, I've been thinking about forever. Ooh, that's what the thinking about you song is. Someone, well, do you ever think sometimes? Hey. Because I've been thinking about forever. Yeah, someone's thinking. Oh, I'm going goosebumps. That's exactly what the song is representing. Someone's thinking about forever with you. Frank Ocean, look it up. Go play the song. Pause this video. Then come back. Because then it's all going to make sense. Your person has been thinking about you. Some air sign. They can have Libra in their chart. They may have been dishonest to you. But with justice, they're bringing in some type of truth. I think your person got karma for what they did to you. And this shit has came back around in this cycle with one of these people. Yep, 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 yep. That was a snake. They were in some demonic energy when it came to this person. And this person should have cut their ass off. Your divine masculine should have cut this person off. Or you, divine masculine... You should have cut that fucking Leo off, that Taurus, that Earth sign off, or water sign. You should have cut that motherfucker off. Mm-hmm. And now you're wanting justice in this situation. You've had a wake-up call. That's what's going on. There's been some clarity. Someone's coming in with honesty. Didn't we say that? Clarity to balance out this situation because they've had karma. Your person's had fucking karma. That's what the hell's going on. Mm-hmm. Your person had, and it put him down. All right, that's it. This is it. This is all that I'm supposed to do. I could probably try and pull one more for y'all, but this is this is it. I mean, I don't. I mean, your person coming back. Your person coming back. They want this marriage. They coming in to tell you how they close this cycle out with one of these motherfucking air signs, earth sign, fire sign, or water sign, because somebody was a snake and some devilish energy. And left they ass single. You, and you probably heard about it. Or they coming in to tell you about this shit. Within this family. Somebody was done bad. When they had their, their back turned. Somebody got betrayed in, with their back turned. I don't need to pull it. Because I already see it. I'm telling you now. And whoever was the one that got betrayed. Your divine masculine. Was the one who put the ending. And walked away from this Leo. Look at them. They in two different directions. The fucking Leo now. Is now trying to have the strength to tame themselves now. I don't know why they, they want to come back to your person or need to entertain themselves. They need to accept that things have ended and move on. Let me see. I just want to see. Look, death again at the bottom. I'm telling you, there's been endings on top of endings. Endings, endings, endings. It could be for, your, for, for the, fuck, the karmic. There's been a lot of endings for the karmic. This person could be a Leo, a Taurus, or a water sign. There has been a lot of endings for a karmic. Yep. Or Divine Masculine has ended a lot of things. You could have ended it too with your Divine Masculine. Two death cards. For some of y'all, you are a Scorpio. Mm-hmm. You're damn sure right. 
I mean, Scorpio, you either got Aquarius, you got Leo, or you got goddamn Taurus in 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 your um. For some of y'all, you, you could be two double Scorpio. Uh huh. Some of y'all got Aquarius, but it's in your chart or the person you're messing with. I feel it's in your chart. Let's clarify here. Any other messages that I need to uh, share with my collectives today? We see now the divine masculine is coming back. This is a true ooh 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 because they ain't been happy without you. That's what the fuck is going on. They want to let your ass know. With the nine of cups, what is this? This is the nine, right? Oh, yeah, nine of cups. Yeah. Someone has been feeling unfulfilled, empty. Mm, 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 mm. They didn't recognize that they had a fucking problem. They were too busy being selfish and greedy. And now maybe it could be due to materialism. It could be the person that they were with, that karmic. I said it was a tourist. If it's a tourist, someone is really materialistic. I said they may have water. Look at all this shit. All these empty cups. Somebody feeling like they got, they they didn't get shit. Bad faith. They, they have, they don't have shit. They invested on something and got shit in return. I'm surprised I won't see the Knight of Pentacles in reverse. Someone invested and got shit in return. Oh shit, I got the Page of Pentacles in reverse. Oh shit, what well, this, this is your per... This, okay, let me calm down because I get really excited because I just told y'all that, that the person that your person was with, they're mad. Look, this page of pentacles, didn't I say they have endings on top of endings? And one of them right now with this young ass page is somebody gossiping about how they're unhappy. Someone's gossiping. This young ass bitch, whoever it was, your person was messing with. Is gossiping about this shit. She gossiping about how she broke as fuck. I right, broke hell. Something that was unexpected. This bitch was a daydreamer. This person was fake as fuck towards your person. Yup. This person was fake as fuck towards your person. This was the person that your person may have been given into. That was fun. Socializing. But when your fucking divine masculine said that they was making a choice and closing out this cycle with this person... Oh, yeah, this person, this, they were shocked. This shit was unexpected. They lost it all. Look at all these motherfucking cups empty. Look, draining. Just imagine all these tall cups just, just dumped, dumped. So, didn't I just tell you somebody wasted? Somebody invested in something that was a waste with this person. Somebody was young, immature, careless. Look at this shit. All I need right now is like a wands, maybe a, a ten of wands, uh, you know, irresponsible, in a fucking reverse. Instead of a burden, too many responsibilities. Look at this bitch unexpected no hope daydreaming ass bitch because you know why she never thought that your person would drop that ass she thought she would always be the shit and that your person will always be dreaming and daydreaming about her oh yeah but when that motherfucker dropped that ass oh yeah this bitch was this shit was unexpected yep there's no hope in this situation bitch because you're too fake as fuck and your person your divine masculine is thinking about you. He wants marriage with you. I don't know if there was something at some point where he wanted some family with this bitch, but no, he didn't close out that cycle. This cycle that he wants to be closed out is with you. And he's having the strength, the courage to tame himself in a situation when it comes to these months. Whoever's in this fucking cycle with his ass that he's trying to close out with, like I said, did not say this was a karmic. Again, this is a karmic cycle your person's trying to close out with. Yes, they can be a Leo. They could be a goddamn, they, uh, they could be, I say Leo. I'm not saying Aries because I don't feel Aries is in here. I say Leo. I don't even feel Sagittarius is in here. I say Leo. But, for, oh, you know what? You know what? Who's a Sagittarius? The karmic. The karmic got Sagittarius in her. This is her trying to tame this situation. Trying to, trying to avoid an ending. Not wanting this cycle to be close because I know the bitch going to be single. Yeah. And this is why this bitch is, yo, they fake as fuck. They pretending here. Look at this. Pretending, yo. The Ten of Cups, somebody's arguing. Some breakup. Bitch was pretending and put your motherfucking person in some type of illusion. Motherfucker, all I know is she's feeling really unfulfilled right now. Feeling really empty. Look at all these goddamn empty cups. Because she was greedy, too materialistic, too selfish when it came to your person. That's what the hell's going on. Your person was was selfish, too motherfucking greedy in this situation. And now your person is coming back towards you. They making a motherfucking decision. As a matter of fact, the person that they was with probably couldn't make a decision. 
Yep, yep, yep. But surprise, someone's preparing a way, developing a plan and making a choice to go in towards a new direction. And that's your divine masculine because he's coming in, offer you that gold. Look at this gold. You don't see all this gold and these pictures. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Baby. Mm -hmm. That's what's going on. Let's find out when, though. I want to pull a little bit more. Let's find out when, guys. Your person's coming, though. They put an end to that other person. That other person, let me tell you right now, that motherfucker kept them in an illusion. They was fake as fuck. Ooh, we're going we gonna to see about these moonology cards. Because I know tomorrow is a, uh, what's tomorrow? The new moon, right? Is it a new moon? Mm-hmm. Yep, it's a new moon. So let's see. Tonight's a wanting moon. Let's see. If tomorrow's a six, it's a new moon. Your person could be coming in around then. Let's see. Holy Spirit, angels, clarify for me. When is this person coming? When is when is the divine masculine coming to see his divine feminine and tell her about this stability? About when he's wanting to get married and, and how he closed out the cycle with this other person. How he put an end to the situation. How he's thinking about his divine feminine. Oh, shit, Lord, thank you. Somebody is like in a spiritual energy. They are, your person has awakened, guys. Your person is woke. I've never believed in no divine mask and divine feminine until now I see this. I'm starting to believe again. But, be, but before, I didn't believe a goddamn thing. So to me, unless they are awakened, they got that message spiritually. Until then, no, motherfucker is not going to be no good. But in this case, I feel this person has gotten their spiritual message and they, they, they've they awakened to the 3D world and they're coming in and now they want to close out the cycle. They're ending all things that no longer serve them. They're having the strength to put, put, to put an ending to this person, this marriage, this third party bullshit. And all they're thinking about is you. You make them happy. You are the one who they want to be with. You are the one that they're romantically fantasizing about. Who they feel they should have used their intuition when it came to motherfucking being successful with you. You were their peace, their financial success, their joy. They should have made a wish with you. You were their harmony. This is your person from the past. Today, this is your divine masculine. Mm, mm, mm. Wow, y'all, I'm scared. Yep. Yep. Nothing will come of this situation. Void, of course. Moon. Wow. Will nothing come of this situation with the person and the one that they're with is the reason why he's coming towards you? Void, of course. Moon. There, it must be void, of course. Moon. Void, of course. A moon. Could it be a Cancer? Could it be a Pisces that they're Nothing will come of this situation, which I said your person had water sign. I didn't say Scorpio. I said they had Pisces, a high priestess. That somebody knew this already. I mean, I'm about to pull another one because it says void to void this person. If this person has cancer or Pisces, nothing will come of this situation, y'all. But we pulled Scorpio. So for some of y'all, if it's a cancer or a Pisces, do not go. Nothing will come of this situation. Let me pull for some of y'all that are not. Yeah, but saying something's not going to... Or if the person that they were fucking with was a Cancer or a Pisces, nothing came of that situation. I think it's this. Here it is right here, this Page of Pentacles. Because the Page of Pentacles is an earth sign. The Nine of Cups, that's water. I said someone had water or earth or fire and earth in their chart. And nothing came of this. Nothing came of this with your person. Your person got... Didn't I say that? Didn't I say... That's what this is. That's exactly what this is. Somebody gave their all and got shit in return. They didn't get nothing. They didn't get a goddamn thing. And that's the reason why they're making this decision to come towards you. Because this person right here gave them nothing. That's why all these cups are empty. Nothing came of this fucking relationship. Nothing came of that fucking relationship. Nothing. Mm-hmm. Nothing came of that fucking relationship with the karmic. Exactly. Because karma, your, per your person and the person he was fucking with got karma. 
your person woke up in this situation this other person i don't know what they tried to do but they got nothing out of it this fucking earth sign with fire or water whatever wish fulfillment whatever they tried to do here they broke up nothing came out of this shit these motherfuckers broke up they broke up yep and now this bitch is feeling empty because she was selfish they're feeling unfulfilled because nothing they got out of this they got nothing out of it and your person is voiding this person too wow yep 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 they got nothing out of it regarding this person that's why they put it deaf to the situation for some of y'all y'all might feel the same way like no i'm not moving forward with you because i'm not getting nothing out of it some of y'all y'all divine masculine is coming back you're not letting them back in y'all because y'all feel like i don't know they're gonna betray you again they already left you stuck they put you in a lot of illusions. They were greedy. They were selfish. They left you empty and materialistic. Some of y'all was like, no, nothing's going to come out this situation. I'm not moving forward with you. I already know what you're about. Wow. That's why nothing is going to come out of this. Oh, shit. This was one of them tough-ass readings, but this was the motherfucking tea. And if it resonated, please like, share, and subscribe. But somebody's divine masculine is coming back. Some of y'all are taking them, and some of y'all are not. A time for healing. Mm. New moon. For some of y'all. There it is. It's a time to heal. And that's probably what you're doing. That's probably what your person is doing. That's probably why they're needing the strength. But whatever is happening right here. For some of y'all. You're not going to get nothing. Ooh, you know why? Because your person needs to make some adjustments. That's why. Because the adjustments are required. Your person needs to make some fucking adjustments. But... I already said I saw that them that they awakened. And look, look at that moon. This is the reason why nothing never worked out is because that cancer of Pisces needed to make some fucking adjustments and they didn't. Mm. Third, look at that third, third quarter, third party. Mm -hmm. Adjustments are required. That bitch ain't want to make no adjustments. This was definitely a cancer or a Pisces. Yep, 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 yep. And right here, right here, this is the person adjustments third third quarter moon this was the third party there was adjustments that were required that nothing came of it the bitch never was willing to change they were not willing look from a full moon to just a little half this is barely even a half moon it, look there was too much shit somebody wasn't willing to change their ways and that's why your person left this person because nothing good came out of it this person needed to make some fucking adjustments and that when it comes to a third party and that's what it is that's why you guys are not wanting to give in you feel this person is fake as fuck they come in with this something unexpected but you guys don't have any hope in this situation you don't see your wishes being fulfilled because you feel nothing's going to come out of it because this person hasn't changed and until they do you guys are avoiding the course of this moon and like i said it could be a third party, it could be a Cancer, it could be a Pisces, or it could be in their chart. Thank you for watching. Peace.